I'm Tracy Ellis Ross. I'm in a stranger's pool with a glass of rosé. Let me tell you something. Life is good. <laughs> Did you just say, why do people love me? You can't answer that question. <laughs> Lessons in love? No, could you teach me some? <laughs> wow. I learned the most about love from my dog, Ladybug, but I learned from my family how to show up, that love is not necessarily just all about ease, it's about showing up for somebody, and that's the way my family operates. And then I really learned it on another level with my dog, and showing up for her, and you know, our little relationship, our little, our little world. She's no longer with us, but the lessons, they remain. How would I define poise? Well, it's not pose and it's not porpoise. I think it's somewhere in the world of elegance. Elegance and poise, I think, could be interchangeable. Why, well, I don't know, do people love me? I mean, that's hilarious. I, I, have, I have no idea because they're ridiculous. Here's, here's what I'll say. I hope that people feel like themselves when they're around me and feel safe to be themselves when they're around me. And maybe that makes people think it's me that they love, but it's really themselves that they love. How about that? Oh, come on, don't be ridiculous. Just have a sip of wine. Hello, wine. Hello, Tracy. How are you? I'm ready to be drank by you. Oh, I'm ready to drink you. Shall we? I have to pick a favorite person in the world. My God, this is so political. My favorite person in the world. I'll tell you who. Mom, Dad, Ronda, Tracy, Jenny, Ross, Evan. Have you ever met that person? Amazing. my thoughts on self-love, I feel like self-love is a daily reprieve. I think self-love and self-esteem come from esteemable acts and loving action, both towards self and others. And the truth is that my self-love has been earned through service, being present and available for other people, showing up, listening. These are the things that make me feel like a member of the world, a fellow among fellows. Uh-oh, tomatoes down! Pshht, pshht, pshht. I personally am a pool over an ocean or sea gal, but don't get me wrong, I'll take the sea, like if I'm in Italy, like what, I'm gonna say no, I wanna be in a pool, no! I feel like a pool offers you a lot of organization, water organization. In the pool, I'm in charge. You know what I mean? I'm in charge of my space, my bubble, my water. In the ocean, there's sand. There's nothing organized about the sand. Cameras are on, right? Just wanna make sure. Going in for the handstand. <gasps> Did you get it? You, I nailed it. Yes! Water in the air. I love trees. I find myself feeling most at home with trees. If you're having a rough day, look at trees. If you're having a rough day, sit at the base of a really big tree that has really deep roots. If you have questions that you need answered from a really deep place, sit under a tree and ask the tree. I always love to say hello to trees. I'm just telling you, that's what I do. What a lovely time we've had. It's been amazing. I'm definitely very pruney, and it's time for us to go. And by us, I mean you. Get out. It's time for me to just swim away. <laughs> <laughs>